I think we might have found our man. And he's a gaudy one. Yeah. Not so fast, buddy. Back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. We're looking for someone. Let me guess. First time in Walmart, kid. Yeah? So? So people can't just walk through the dumb's front door. Especially men. How about me, then? Can I go inside? Maybe. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute! Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Kinda cute's not gonna cut it. Come on, can't you help us out? Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith. Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Cloud, requesting permission to kill. Denied. <sighs> if you're really sure you want to join an audition, then you're gonna need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. The only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, there's Chocobo Sam. And then there's Madame M over at the massage parlor. Last but not least, there's the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Hmm. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. Aerith, you sure about this? 
If you've got any better ideas. Not really. So that's the way it is. Hmm. Tifa's been invited into the Don's estate. Huh? But to earn such a privilege, you must first win the approval of one of the trio. Right? Meaning, I now know what I must do to save her. Stay strong, Tifa! Help is on the way! Johnny's coming, baby! <laughs> Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? Nope. Shell of a man without my inspiration. Leave me alone. I'm nothing but a hollow shell of a man without my inspiration. I'm a little town in the It's a hard lesson, but one you have to learn. You ready for Yeah. Kiss my ass. Not if you don't make it out of here alive first. Can't have just one. The more you eat, the better they get. Fresh huh? chocobo bean popcorn. Hey there, friend. Grab a seat. Any seat that's open. So, what will it be? Made a little extra. We spend on some good eating. If you don't know, we're dead. It's quite crowded at the moment, but I'll see what I can do. Have a safe trip. What the hold on? What are you thinking? Stupid, stupid, stupid! Crawl into a hole and die! Not you two again. Told you once, I'll tell you a thousand times. Got nothing for you. Now scram. Wait, here's out. You're one of the trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Huh? Pretty please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around, I'll put your name in the hat. Next time will be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. Hardy recommended Tifa. She's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Corneo will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. Then how's about we play for it? Call it, Missy. Heads or tails? Yes, right. I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> Guess wrong, and you'll leave me in peace. Heads. Tails, you lose. <sighs> hey, don't look so glum. You're a pretty enough gal. Just not quite Corneo's cup of tea. <laughs> but if only the Don will do, try convincing one of the other two. That's why it's a trio and not just the Mio. Now skip daddle. Wait. 
Mind if I see that coin of yours? Trick coin. I had a hunch. That's cheating! And that's the wall market way. Lesson learned. Still cheating. I guess they're closed right now? Oh, there's this energy pulsing from my fingertips. There's something downright wrong with this place. They're ripping off you and me and <sighs> every part of us. Hey, you think that guy's doing okay? He wasn't looking so hot, you know. Maybe we should go check on him? But this street, isn't it? The one that everyone says is bad news? Shit, you're right. I don't want to go down there now. No place to hang out. You feel me? Ain't nobody gonna give a shit if you get your throat cut here. Hey, bro, this ain't ain't nobody gonna give a shit if you get your throat cut here. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> what happened with you know what? Aren't you a curious cat, walking dark alleys? You've got balls, so I'll give you a pass. This once. Wait, you don't mean the newbie too, right? I said deal with it. You didn't see or hear anything. You get me? Wait, you don't mean the newbie too, right? I said deal with it. Can't have this coming back on Sam or the Dawn. I understand. <laughs> My, what lovely weather we're having. Oh. Yep. <laughs> they call uh. themselves bankers, but they just know the show. This is four, two. Uh, I swear. I feel guilty. Mm. Yeah, man. It wasn't supposed to go down like this. Is this the place? I wanted to see Andrea. I think so. Curse my weak. Let girl. me handle this. What? You wait out here, okay? And why would I do that? No, I'm coming with. I'm not really sure that... You're a man of many talents, but talking isn't one of them. I am but a feeling. Whoa. <laughs> Good evening. Welcome to the heart and soul of Wall Market, the Honey Bee Inn. Is there a honey boy or girl whose company you desire? Uh, we're here to see Andrea Rodea. Ah, the shining star of the Honey Bee Inn. Now, are you the one who made the appointment, sir? Can I have your name? Oh, we don't have an appointment. I see. 
I'm terribly sorry, sir. An appointment is required, and the earliest available slot is three years from now. Three years? All we want is five minutes. He can spare that. I need his help for the Corneo audition. Yes, well, regardless of the circumstances, you cannot meet him without an appointment. Is there really no other way? It is rare. But Mr. Rodea does occasionally extend invitations to individuals who catch his eye. Otherwise, I'm sorry, but there really is nothing that can be done. I guess that's that then. Oh well, let's try someone else. Hey, are you nervous to... You bet I am! This is the first time in the past it's gonna be a monster. Wait! Maybe the breeze will sober you up. two of you step right up now then what manner of massage do you desire say what is this your first time in our establishment mm -hmm. we are a hand massage parlor an excess of fatigue and tension can make even the simplest task a terrible strain it is our pleasure to relieve our patrons of that tension <laughs> and what better way to seek relief than through the skilled ministrations of a professional so now that we understand each other, what manner of massage do you desire? We're not customers. Then you are... Hoping you can help us get an invite to an audition with oh, Don... Oh, uh, Say another word and I'll shove this fan right down your throat. Oh. Uh. Uh, this is the last thing I need. You're young and stupid, and I suppose that means you think I'll let you off easy. So, you want what? A favor? Well, here's the thing. This is a massage parlor, a respectable establishment. But if you don't require our services, then tell me! Is there any reason I shouldn't have you dragged outside and shot for wasting my valuable time? Well? <laughs> hmm. Name? Cloud Strife. Hand. Huh? Give it to me! The strong, firm hands of a fighter, yet they possess a certain elegance and grace. Okay, Cloud, let's see what you're made of. After that, we'll talk. So, which course will it be? your way to the room in the back and wait. Cloud? Well then, it should go without saying that you get what you pay for. All four fingers at once, quick and to the point. A little rough. Hmm? They can stop at any time if it's too much to handle. Try flexing the muscles. You'll feel the difference. Mm -hmm. 
Loose and limber. Am I right? Actually, yeah. Hmm. How was it? It's all right, I guess. What are you doing? Flexing. Flexing. Uh, never mind. Hm. Think you'll make a habit of it? <sighs> All right then. I think I've seen everything I need to see. So, tell me what you want, and we'll take it from there. You're one of the trio, right? I want to get into Corneo's next audition. And why in the world would you want to do that? Hmm... Okay. Really? But, you cannot go dress like that. Huh? I could never send Carneo a candidate wearing such a plain-looking getup. Doing so would call my position as one of the trio into question. Is something wrong with my outfit? It's comfortable, isn't it? Cloud the fashion critic. Look, just take it outside the parlor, would you? Sorry, we'll stop. So... What should I do about the outfit? <laughs> you just leave that to me. I'll put you in a dress so fabulous, you'll look like a million gill. So long as you can afford it. How much? What I said. But don't worry. It's obvious you can't afford a dress with that kind of price tag. So listen, I have an idea. Uh. There's an underground coliseum in this town. Up for a fight, Cloud? Good. Because I'm getting you into that arena. If you win the tournament, I'll transform Aerith into a drop-dead gorgeous beauty. Is there any prize money? <laughs> yes. For the person who got you in. So, what do you say? All right. That's what I like to hear. You'll need this. They're already letting fighters inside. You should hurry. Run along. What have we gotten ourselves into? Nothing good. I wouldn't expect a fair fight in this town. Think we can win it all? That's one thing I'm definitely sure of. I appreciate the confidence, just don't get too cocky, okay? Mm. Spectators only. What's this? You're here to compete? <laughs> I hope you know you're cutting it really close. So, the two of you are a team? A team? No, it's just me. Yes, the two of us are a team. I need to get into that audition, but I won't let anyone else fight my battles for me. That includes you, mister. Alright, team it is. Head to the waiting area down below. Down, down, down we go. So, how deep does this thing go, you think? I wonder how many people are fighting. 
Hey, you're not nervous, are you? Nope. Really? You're even more quiet than usual. Just trying to focus, like you should. You two, wait here until it's time. You two, wait here until it's time. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you again. Ouch, what happened to your face? I just needed a little scratch, you know? So I signed up for the preliminaries and, well, I hope you guys realize you're getting into. I don't want to scare you, but if you can make a run for it, you should. Cloud and Aerith, your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. We're in way too deep to back out now. You two ready? Try not to get yourselves killed. For our next batch, we welcome two fighters, a young couple no less. Talking about a bad day? And this is their first tournament, the bad first date, and most likely their last, inexperienced as they are. Or are they? Give it up for Cloud and Eric! Bullshit. What's up with the pole? Gonna do a little dance for us, baby girl? Okay, now I'm mad. Seriously, one of Walmart's own, a renowned master of beasts. Will his pets make a meal of our two challengers before our very eyes? They've already been given their appetite. Their hunger for flesh and fear is unquenchable. The demon dogs of hell, the sanguine stalker! Beast. 
You brought animals? Oh, first timers, huh? There's no rule that says you gotta fight man to man. We're in for a treat, ladies and gentlemen. Who will prevail in this turtle contest between man and beast? This could be over in an instant, so don't even play. Without further ado, the fourth match of the first round begins now! <laughs> <laughs> I got your number. I'm waiting. How's that feel? On you. I'll take care of them. Don't catch a cold. Hang back. don't make sense. Yeah, true. But maybe it'll be better in the next match? Nah. Wouldn't bet on it. Better to expect the worst. Huh. You've got some time before your next match. Get some rest. Cloud and Aerith. Your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. <laughs> <laughs> 